He's like, excuse me, she didn't move, so we just pushed our way right through. floor of the Mets. We're headed back to the new sauna with all of our bags to drop it all off there so we can go explore the rest of the day. Calvin, do you usually do it on the floor? Yeah. anyone that comes here with the buses if you're using Google Maps it'll tell you which bus you need to be on but there's some tricky situations where like there's a bus stop here but there's also a bus stop on that side of the road and on Google Maps it shows everything on just one side of the road no matter which way it's going so you need to watch which way you're supposed to be traveling to know which side of the road to be on because the same number buses stop at all the same places because there's only like a 6, 87, 77, 97. There's only a handful of numbered buses that stop. Definitely pay attention to which direction you need to be traveling and which side of the road you're on. That's gotten us a couple of times and we went the wrong way and are like, well crap, now we don't know where we are. Well, these are different kind of buses. Yeah. These don't take people to school. We just finished up breakfast at the Nusano. We went back, took our bags, and then got some food. They have a pretty decent buffet there that we thought was gonna be like a $20 buffet or something. It was a $9.95 breakfast buffet. It was pretty decent. I uh, swiped some bananas for later. Ha! But now we're headed to the Metro to go back to Odiva. We wanna get another backpack and we don't know that there's any more Nike stores anywhere. I'm sure there is, we just don't know where or if they'll have the same backpack deal. So we're gonna go and get Travis a backpack so we don't have to carry around that weird gray bag anymore, which is also a Nike bag, I think. Yeah. But it's weird. We're pretty much masters of the Metro at this point. Masters of the Metro. <laughs> Hardly masters. We do, we don't know. looks so happy. Look at him. We made it to where we need to be and one just to left. But I felt like an expert, like we were just going right through, like we knew where we were supposed to go because we literally went the same way yesterday. It's kind of nice to like know where you're going and not feel lost, but I don't think I could do this every day. <laughs> well, if you did it every day, you'd be, you'd be an expert. Yeah. They, like, I don't think they ride like new lines all the time. Like, yeah. Nobody. You can tell the ones that do because they have Google Maps pulled up. Yeah, like they, if they ride the same line, they know when it's going to be there every day. More breakfast. Do you like riding the trains? The train smells good in That last one did smell good. I think it's funny that he notices that stuff though. Yeah, Those are long tags. Yeah. That's your new shirt you got yesterday. Two new shirts. I don't want to rip it off because it's the one that's like sewn in. It'll make a hole. We made it back to the same mall we were at yesterday, which is like Pallet Town, I believe, Venus Fort. They're about to open. We've come back for another. Yeah. You wanna look at anything else? We literally came all this way just for a backpack. And we got it! So now we have two new backpacks for traveling. So now we're headed back basically the same way we just came from to go to the Ueno Zoo. Chura Zoo! But we need to put more money on our Suica cards. So we need to find machines, which I think are up here. Yeah, well, no, right on the right side. All right, so to re reload these, put your card in, put the money you want, easy peasy, Japanesey. That was racist. Take my money. All right. New balance, my turn. Thank speed. you! And you can buy these here, right? Yeah. It's uh, that one. Yeah, English. 500 yen. Oh, you can um, put your name on it. But we just got the ones that are less personal. You can get one with your name on it, though. 
but these machines is how you get one if you need one. And I highly recommend getting one. I'm really glad she told us how. Because these have been a lifesaver. You just reuse them and then can scan them through anywhere. You can use them on the bus, on the trains, on the metro, everything. You swipe it going through and it will tell you your balance. And then once you get off your train and out of the gates on the other side, it will deduct however much more because you have to scan it again. And like it's that fast. There are so many people that have them, they just go through and it beeps the whole time. Beep, 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 beep. And you can keep it in your wallet and just press your wallet down on there and it's fine. So you don't have to take it out every time. But I don't have an easy wallet like that, so I just put it in my pocket. A lot of people put them on the back of their phones. Yeah. Like between the phone and the case. Yeah, or if you have the, the flip case that has the yeah. the card thing, you will just have it in their phone and it's it will scan through stuff, basically is what I'm trying to say. Yep, and the vending machines. And there's lockers, which we've used before, where you can put all your stuff in and you scan your Suica card, and no one else can open it because you have to open it with your card. I'm not using bathroom here, that line is way too long. You can pretty much use them for everything. And there's shops throughout like the stations that you can use them at as well, and like they all take the same card. It's pretty handy, get one. the train and walked up to the top and the zoo is across well like it's this one big park and I think the zoo is like inside the park because there's like museums and a bunch of I don't even know what else here there's just a bunch and there's a lot of people May 4th happens to be free admission though so we can go for free Day to come to the zoo. It's insane. He's a turkey. Hi, little turkey. Hello, little birdie. He is so big. I've been thinking, you know, it'd be amazing, like when Calvin falls asleep, if we had something to carry him with, seeing everyone wearing babies here. So I was like, I want to see if I can put Calvin in my backpack. Why is he pushing on my head? He's just leaning. So, so we're trying it out. Calvin's in my backpack. Baby wearing. Baby wearing in the backpack. Is it working? It's working. He's kind of heavy, <laughs> but he's 40 pounds. Yeah. So that's to be expected. Like we need to go this way. Because we're trying to avoid all this. But I'm pretty impressed with myself. That was a good thought. Does it look silly? Look kind of normal. No, I mean his shorts are a little bunched up. We've had a little change in direction here. We're not gonna stay at the zoo because it was way too packed. So now we're gonna go to the Sky Tree. But we need to find where our connecting train is at here. Subway. I keep saying train. They're all subways, metros. Whatever. It's all the same. But we had to switch off on the Calvin Carry. Because even though he's strapped in, it's still pretty heavy. He's 40 pounds. <laughs> It's a lot of weight. What in the world is that? I think it's massive. We're on the fourth floor now at the Sky Tree, and people aren't getting this whole right side walk thing and are just stopping. But the first couple of escalators we went up, they were walking on the right side and were stopped on the left. And just one lady was stopped on the right, and Travis was like, Zoom in his head, which is, Excuse me, she didn't move. He's like, Excuse me, she didn't move. So we just way right through because apparently some people aren't getting it and it's really hard to grasp people are kind of like rude here in a way it's not at all like Okinawa like in Okinawa everyone's so considerate and like oh no you go first but here it's totally the opposite people are rude and care about themselves and stand in the way and are on their own time oh it's a really hard thing to grasp So we're kind of wanting to 
to be cheap again and we got all the way up here to where we buy tickets and it's 3,000 yen per person if you go up to what the 350th floor and then 4,000 yen per person if you go up to like the 450th floor or something like that and we're like crap we just wasted another trip all the way here so we sat down and taking a break let Calvin rest for a second and then we're like we've come all this way it's just wasted time if we don't go at this point and I keep getting everyone else excited and we keep getting about going to these places and then we're like ah just kidding it's, it's too expensive and we don't go and we haven't done anything else that we've really wanted to because it's been too expensive we're just gonna go for it we're gonna get back in line we're gonna get our tickets we're gonna go all the way to the top so these are the fast access prices right now and these are the regular prices what it would be if we wanted to go all the way to the top so we're like how fast is the fast access like is it worth buying it and she's like ah yeah it's about 15 minutes and we're like okay and how fast is the other one how long would it take she's like five hours <laughs> we'd have to come back at 7 30 tonight or wait in line until 7 30 tonight to go the regular route so we're just gonna pay extra we're just gonna go to the top we don't even care we're doing it never okay. gonna be back yeah we'll probably never be back here so we might as well do it now because we want to swim and we've been promising Calvin that he could swim and I think we're all just kind of tired. We'll head back, swim, relax, and if we want to go out later then we can, but we totally don't have to. We can just eat at the hotel and be lazy if we want to. Right here. We've done a lot of walking. That's what we want, right? It is. A way to tell if you're going the right way is there will be signs on the wall. The right side says Kinshincho. I think, and on our list of stops, 
The first one is that word, whatever that was. So that's how to tell if you're going out the right way. We were almost back to the hotel and we were thinking we should probably get something to eat before we get there. So we're stopping at this ramen place that's on this pretty cute little street, actually. So we're gonna eat some food and then head back to the pool. You excited, Calvin? The restaurants are considerably smaller here and there's only two family-sized tables there, so we're at the bar. We just got what would be like dinner at that most random ramen place and it was probably the best fried rice I've had. And I don't say that about a lot of stuff, I don't like pick favorites with stuff, but that was so good. What is this? Chocolate! 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 I just wanna like... Chocolate pizza. Slice. Oh, my stomach is so full. Salted caramel chalk tail. <laughs> Not funny? Okay. I'll get that. I want that. <laughs> yes, I have feelings and you can hurt them. Feelings. Oh, uh, then you can hurt them if you say the wrong things. 80s milkshake has ice cream on top. I want the salted caramel chalk tail. Is it? Yes. Scoop of ice cream! And it's just chocolate? Straight out of the Hershey's syrup container. Is it coming out? I like this one more. It's stuck to the bottom, that's it's why. Like, it tastes like burnt caramel. Oh god, it is thick. <laughs> yeah, that's why I was like... <laughs> tastes like legit caramel, that's why. It tastes like burnt. I need a bigger straw, that's good. Max Brenner, never heard of it. That's what that was though, it's a chocolate place. You can get all things chocolate. Red light. We're walking back to the hotel Red though. Light. We're probably 10 minutes away. Red we'll be light. there soon. Back to head to the pool. Obviously I'm gonna take this off. You're gonna take your shirt off. You're gonna take your shirt off. We're gonna go swim. But my camera is at 5%. So we're gonna go swim. You guys are gonna charge and we'll be back. We are back from swimming. It is eight o'clock. I've already showered. Travis has been doing some laundry while I've been working on videos because I'm trying to get this video up for you guys. Travis just went to switch out the laundry and brought me back some ice water because they have a nice machine. I'm gonna work on videos for a little bit longer and then we might quite possibly go and do something, but I don't know what. Maybe get more food or something. I don't know. It's our last night, so I don't just wanna just sit, but I don't wanna do anything crazy either because I'm kind of tired. It's 9.30 now and I'm still working on videos. Travis has finally picked up the laundry because it's finally, finally done. And I thought it was funny, putting a bag on my head. Is it funny? It's funny. I don't think it's funny. <laughs> it's perfect. You have a horn. And Kevin's asleep. He couldn't hang. Ah, my hat fell off. I'm almost done. <laughs> it's so long. I want ice cream. It's 11.30 and we woke Calvin up so that we could go down to Family Mart. We let him sleep for a couple of hours because he was dead. Like he laid down to watch TV and passed out. So we walked down to Family Mart, got some snacks, and now we're just gonna hang out. It was our last night. But Calvin told me, well, they both told me, that Calvin decided I'm not sleeping there. That they're gonna sleep in this bed and I have to sleep over here. I, I wanna sleep over here. No, you sleep over there. This bed's comfy. That's comfy too. 
No, it's not. <laughs> it is. How about we all sleep in this bed? That would be so cool. That would be so cool. So we're gonna hang out and watch some Food Network Channel for a little while. It's 12.30 and we are going to sleep. I was falling asleep laying here. Actually not falling asleep. I fell asleep. For now that is that. We will see you when we see you. Bye! Why is everyone yellow? We're yellow.